zelf ook even doen. Ja. Yeah. I'm talking to Jeroen Bronkhorst. And Jeroen, you're presenting together with a bunch of partners. Um, no, sorry. I'm talking to Jeroen Bronkhorst. He's responsible in the Netherlands for blockchain applications. And Jeroen, with a number of partners, you're presenting a very interesting medical case with tracking and tracing on the blockchain. What is the company called and what are they doing? So the company is called uh, Nico Lab. Um, they are a split off of the uh, AMC, the Amsterdam Medical Center. Mm -hmm. um, and they are actually uh, improving uh, the treatment of stroke, people who have uh, had a stroke. Um, 25 seconds, uh, every 25 seconds, there's people in the, in the European Union that get a stroke. Mm -hmm. And every two minutes, uh, someone dies from a stroke. So it's very important that treatment starts as quickly as possible. Mm -hmm invented a very interesting artificial intelligence algorithm that helps uh, specialists to um, do a better diagnosis of the stroke that has happened. Mm -hmm. uh, and um, this company is specialized in, in helping those specialists to improve the outcome of a stroke because every uh, hour that you can save uh, 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 significantly improves the, uh, the result yeah. with, with over 30%. Okay, and they're using artificial intelligence, hooray, big data, artificial intelligence to make sure. Now, we're going to see that. And the person who is going to uh, present uh, on, on June the 7th, uh, she's called Merel Boers. What, what is her background? She is uh, uh, the chief research officer of, uh, of uh, Nicolab. Mm -hmm. um, and, uh, and, and she can tell everything about, uh, let's say, the... Um, the business side of this of this case um, and of the deep learning of uh, yeah of the deep learning she has an uh, she has an actually an, uh, a phd on that it's, it's already started in 2014 so that's really interesting so that is in itself really interesting but of course now it's interesting what role does the blockchain have to offer in this project so blockchain is a very key component in this whole process in making sure that um, the scan uh, of someone's brain is actually uh, stored uh, in a way that is immutable uh, and stored with all the data associated with the device that it was scanned with, the specialist that is treating, etc. Mm -hmm. uh, so the blockchain in this case is used as a means to communicate as well as a, a means to um, provide a, uh, an audit trail of actually what happened uh, in analyzing this scan. Okay, so both the um, machine and the doctor are identified and are basically the hash is stored on the blockchain and it, it connects so that everybody's sure that that's really the diagnosis and the ba basic material is for real. Uh, the company who's building, uh, who's helping to build that application is Timeless. That's a partner of yours. Uh, I mean, I've known them for a, a while. They've, done, they've been very active in this uh, case. And, and what can you tell me about them? Well, Timers is a very interesting company. Uh, they have a, a blockchain solution uh, based on uh, BitChain DB. Um, they have complemented this uh, technology with some extra modules that allow integration with legacy, that allow smart uh, um, programming, uh, visual programming of smart contracts, uh, and all kinds of other interesting, um, let's say, technology enhancements. Mm -hmm. And together with them, uh, we have combined that with... Um, uh, our hardware to come up with a blockchain in a box uh, solution that actually can be implemented in a very short time frame. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Blockchain out of a box. You have a fast blockchain with lots of transactions and ready and easy to set up. And you can, with your uh, system, select a number of nodes who can trust each other so that it's clear that, uh, that uh, everybody can... Um, Trust the information which is in there. Okay, so on uh, June the 7th in the uh, in the technical track, you're going to, pre so this Miro Boers is presenting that and uh, also the, the, the background, the technical background from BigChainDB and Timeless and, and, and the whole blockchain in the box is also uh, talked about. So interesting, yes. wonderful. That's going to be fascinating. It's really going to be very, very useful that those kinds of innovations in the medical world can spread out in a way that you don't have to fight in all the different medical systems. So I'm looking forward to see that discussion. Thank you very much, Jeroen. You're welcome. Thank you.